Let's make some stained glass. Let's make art together with Miss Mullins today. All right, if you would like to follow along, you'll need some thin paper. Here I have some tracing paper. You'll need something to go underneath the paper. I have a folded piece of newsprint. You'll need a Sharpie, crayons, or if you have them, oil pastels. Some oil, any kind of oil will do, and some cotton rounds or cotton balls. All right, so to begin, I made a sketch for myself. A good idea is to look up some stained glass examples. You may find something that you really like and you want to kind of base your own artwork off of. Here I've used a telescope goldfish and some lily pads because I really like goldfish. All right, so I'm starting my sketch with pencil. Now the best idea is always to go very lightly at first. You want to be able to erase if you feel like you've made a mistake. Once I'm done drawing with pencil, I'm going to outline with a Sharpie. Now I do have some little details here and there, so it helps to have a fine tip Sharpie on those parts, but the rest I did with the bold tip. Now that I'm done outlining, I'm going to start coloring with my oil pastels. Now I suggest that you try and stay inside the lines as best as possible. If you try and color over the lines, you may risk smudging some things. All right, once you're done coloring, you're going to take your artwork and flip it over. Then you're gonna take your cotton ball or cotton round and you're going to add some oil to it. Then you're going to coat the back side of your artwork with this oil. Once you've got a nice film of oil on the back, Gently pick it up and bring it to your window. Once you're at your window, you'll take the oil side and place it against the window and straighten it up and pat it down. Once you've done that, you have your own stained glass windows. 